This is the American M1 Abrams main battle tank, and this is the second most produced tank in history, the T-72. We are going to compare them against each other and determine which one is more lethal. During the Gulf War, these tanks were crucial in the Battle of 73 Easting. Let's take a look at their ammunition. The Silver Bullet, the M829A1, used by M1A1 Abrams tanks during Operation Desert Storm. The following simulation witnesses the Silver Bullet impacting the T-72 M1's upper front plate. The frontal armor of a T-72 consists of composite materials, such as armor steel and textilite. The M829A1 was designed in the late 80s as a response to improved Soviet armor. As it can be seen, the M829A1 is able to fully penetrate the armor arrangement thanks to its depleted uranium. Let's move on to our next contender. This is the 3BM22, also known as the Springer. It was a primary armor-piercing ammunition used by Iraqi crews during 1991. This simulation depicts the Springer impacting the frontal plate of an M1A1 Abrams, angled at 82 degrees. The extreme slope is intended to cause APFSDS projectiles to shatter upon impact. Unfortunately, it fails to stop the 3BM-22 from penetrating. However, American tanks typically engaged Iraqi armor first, making use of their thermal imagers. Notably, there were no reported M1 casualties during the Battle of 73 Easting. Which one of these iconic tanks do you like more? Tell us in the comments below.